Hey Keith, I got your email this morning and I wanted to respond to your questions. Um, I'm going to respond to each question in a separate video because this is, these are all questions that come up a lot and I'll share them with you and I'll share them with other men. Your first question was basically, how do I treat my wife? And for context, anybody else who might watch this, in this case, your wife has said, essentially, though she may be willing to stay married to you, she basically wants to be sort of roommates. She wants to have her own life. She wants to possibly be involved romantically with other people. Um, but she wants you to basically not touch her, not try to be, you know, husbandly towards her and whatnot. So how should you treat a woman like this? This is an interesting one. Um, I believe if a woman is asked to not, to not be your wife, uh, at least by function and not necessarily by title, meaning if she wants to not be wifely and doesn't want to be a romantic partner and, and really just wants you to keep providing and protecting for her, I think what you should treat her like uh, relationship-wise is like you would treat any other woman who is not your wife. So how do you act towards women that are not your wife? Are you a jerk? Probably not. You're too good of a man for that. You probably have a lot of virtuous ways that you are towards a woman. But at the same time, I'm guessing that you don't shelter, house, and provide for a bunch of women that are not your wife either. And so you have to look at it that way too. What is a man who loves, values, and respects himself? How does he treat the women in his life that are not his wife? That's what you should do with your wife. If your wife uh, has said that that's who she wants to be, then give her to that, give her that experience with excellence. Okay, to do anything differently is one, not to honor exactly what she's asked for, and two, to dishonor yourself. It is my belief and experience talking to hundreds of men that if you have to dishonor yourself to show someone else honor, that's a zero sum game. There's no way forward for either of you. And really, if you stay married, it'll only be a technicality. Uh, because a woman can't ultimately be in love with and passionate and connected with a man who does not love and respect himself. And a man that'll house people indefinitely and shelter them, who at the same time say he's not worthy of their love, uh, he's not respectable. So I hope that's clarified things. I hope that you love and respect yourself and that in a place of love and respect for your true authentic self and a love of her and herself that you can erect those boundaries and say, yeah, this is, this is exactly how I need to be and what needs to happen from here. So let me know what that looks like for you and best wishes, brother. Take care.